What's up guys, it's the Dark Supremacy here, playing a brand new video, and today we're playing Life is Strange, because why not? So, I've never played this game before, and um, uh, let's see how it goes. So, we're just going to press any button, but I always press the X button. <laughs> Lol. Oh, damn. I'm going to shut up, I'm going to shut up, okay. I hope you enjoy the guys the cutscenes. This is very spooky. Where we play right lighthouse is this way okay i'm assuming we're just following this path dude this game is weird can i walk faster if i can slightly oh cutscene Shit. Whoa. It's a cup. Whatever that's called. I, I, I forgot. The sweepy thing. Oh my god. Oh my god. Whoa. Oh, it was just a that dream. That was so surreal. It's called film Little Pieces of Time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black I didn't fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, cool, Victoria. What? Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. In it. Hi, Arvis. Because of her images of hopeless faces, you feel like I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. But I like it old school. Frankly, it's bullshit. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though. If anybody else looked at this, what would October, my favorite month. The best by the. Let's just read this because this is great. And I can't play out the big coats. Oh, there's a love heart. I can't really be her. Jefferson, and I'm assuming these are her friends. Will it? Okay. Have a very special 18th birthday. <laughs> You're an adult now. But you're still our little girl. <laughs> Check your account. Don't blow it all at once. Oh, we got money. Did we get money? Hmm. I like the dump me. Did you want to get tea later today? <laughs> what does T T Y L mean? I'm not down with the kids. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Let's take a selfie. And any one of you Let's could take a selfie. Isn't that too easy? Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Wow. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portrait uh, so has always been a vital aspect of art and that. photography okay. for as long as it's been around. 
Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Uh, you're asking me? Oh, I didn't know. Okay, um, let's just... You're asking me? L let me think. You can um, do it. You can you do it. You either know this or not, Max. Okay, Is there just chill. Here who knows chill. Their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits Smart a sharp bitch. style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. What an asshole. You're very good, Victoria. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook. Can we swear at people? Even online. Oh, finally. Hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So stop wow, and Alyssa, great. get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Asshole. This is basically a video going to be me just shouting abuse at people. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Even if you're submitting your photo for the competition, everybody in class is turning into Can I swear at them? You see the dilemma? I know, Mr. Jefferson. I just want I'll to suck your dick. And I'm sure you know what it's like to be consumed by I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I'll suck your goddamn dick I've if you let me. I've never let one of future stars avoid handing in her picture. Win. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude like You're a drag. But life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take I have a images. gift at Christmas time. <laughs> you oh, man. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. And it. Man, he even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. Like you you always welcome to the real world. Cute? Yeah, Hot. Black. Then I might send you a special picture. <laughs> hey Shaniqua, get over here. <laughs> you. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I think he's like a total loser. I hate that class, it's so fucking boring. She's so fucking shy. Yeah, this is what I do on the way to school, so nobody talks to me. This is what I don't. This is like me in the morning when I don't want to talk to anyone. Life is strange. Episode one, Chrysalis. I think that's how you say it. To all of you. American girls, it's sad to imagine a world without you. It looks like American she's been gone for months. Girls, I'd like Shame. To be part of the world around they should just call it a sugar machine. I know, isn't it? That would be awesome. Diabetes. Money in there and a bag of sugar dropped out. Watching the world from the bright side. Oh, I can't go that way. This is great. Get a better job. Let's exit this shit. I need to go splash some water on my face and freshen up first. My eyes are stinging. Let's go to the Where's the bathroom?
with shiny smiles and plastic body. Where's the bathroom, guys? Where is it? I wish I is it right across here? Nope. Where the fuck is the bathroom, guys? Where's the bathroom? Oh, the bathroom's over here. It's labelled. But, you know, Will's blind. Empty. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Except for me. I know. Depressing. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. Whoa, what's that about? Oh my god. Ooh, it's a butterfly. When a door closes, mm. a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. It's cool, Nathan. Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just come to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's Ooh. my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Ouch. Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Oh my god! She being showered. Becky, get, call an ambulance. Becky. Whoa. What the fuck? This is... How, how can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. These pieces of time can frame us. I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. She can see into the future. Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now. Shit. Can you give me a <gasps> I cannot believe this. The human in black she don't and fucked up. Okay, if I'm crazy, I might as well go all the way. Mueller. Can I actually reverse time? Go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Okay, this is some crazy ass shit. I actually did it. She has Can magical powers. Yay. Anybody? Bueller? Max, don't Diane. freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because Next. of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted when by When I took my selfie, stuff. Jefferson asked me a question. She saw if he does again, I'll know this is for real. Kids call a 
Selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming this. You all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. Selfie mm -hmm. expression. What if that girl isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save her? Portraiture has always yes. been a vital aspect of art <laughs> and photography. First. I need to go to the bathroom Long quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process? Okay, we've, we've seen this one before. I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. Who knows their Jefferson wants to keep me you after class. And I need yep. time to save Give that him okay. The process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind the again process. and give him the right answer? It takes so long to rewind. Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. <laughs> nice work, Max. Dick. The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular. Mainly because Oh, she's salty. So she is salty. Pictures. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can yeah, sure you'll fly out with them. Stella and Alyssa, get it together. And you'll fly Taylor, the dick in the don't hide. asshole. So for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an Everyday Hero. What the... I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. So you have to play this again. I'd never let one of photography... I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Yes. Exactly. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Yes, Victoria, you still have to do your homework. I see you, Max Caulfield. What? This is just... I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that... Right, this is confusing as shit. Basically, we're just going over the same, Max, same, same thing right. again, again, again. All the right answers. Good. Now let me go. On it by today. I have faith in you. Right, are you letting me go? I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Okay, right. Okay, Max, retrace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in. And I took a photo. Yes, correct. Hey, star. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where did you get that? What are you doing? Don't Come on, put that thing down. Tell me what to do. Wow, sir, it's happening again. I need a hammer to break it open. 
you in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Holy shit, I can't let this happen. If I can reverse time again, I can help her. Even missed your punk ass, would they? No way. Don't ever touch me. I again. saved her. Yay. Another shitty day. That did not happen. This cannot be real. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Pick on Thank side you, of Mr. Bed. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Hold on, Max. Come back here. Come back here. I sound like that person. What's that? You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm I'm just like Morgan worried Freeman. About my he sounds like future. Morgan Freeman. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You could always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. I just saw him. Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott? You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then... then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is... serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? No, nope, you shouldn't because it's confusing as ball. I'll meet you there. He'll say my camera will be ready to see you shortly. I hope so. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. And which way shall it be? Where's the dorm then?
Okay, right, we need to find that. Main building, dormitories. This is so weird. These visions, this power. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Okay. Not that way. Yeah. Do I have to speak to her to get her to move? Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, what wait. a bitch. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh, yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. <laughs> Are you kidding? Look at this! Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how on much this cashmere. fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. How else are we going to get in the room? No. Do you understand English? Get lost. Sorry, no paparazzi allowed. How the hell are we meant to get in? Okay, this is... Yeah. Is it giving us a clue? Understand English? Get lost. No. Awesome. How do we get into the door? Think, Max. Rewind and find something. Samuel is way too close. Okay, right, we have to rewind it. Okay, let's see if this works. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I just want to get Victoria the hell out of the way. Nice, bro. Um, 
are we doing this right? I'm not too sure. Close, but no cigar. They have to be right under the bucket. See if this works. What the hell? Are you kidding? Okay, right. Yes. So it's kind of like almost like a puzzle this game. Okay, Victoria. Oh, Sam, you're sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair. Nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass yeah. before I drive. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Awesome. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you oh. want, Max? I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. <laughs> but there'll be another. I know. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. Yeah. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck your selfie. That was mean, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know? I know but exactly you what you mean, Victoria. Dome. I'll see you later. Au revoir. Victoria probably played me. Hurry, Courtney. Victoria is going to piss me off. Home sweet home, my favorite cocoon. Instant film is so damn hard to find and expensive now. But I can't help it. I'm analog, not digital. Happy birthday, Maxine. <sighs> Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. Okay, right. I think I'll, um... end the, um... the first part of the playthrough here. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Tune in for more. More Life is Strange. And more videos and live streams in the future. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave it a like and subscribe for more. I'm out. Peace.